Hey guys, what's going on? Steve, I'm back again, and it's time for episode 10 of Via the Walking Dead. I am hoping this episode is going to be a lot better than episode 9. Episode 9 was just very... Well, it was a filler episode. I mean, that's not something you want to start... Start the second half of the season with, is a filler episode. You know, usually you want to start the season with a bang, end with a bang, start the mid-season with a bang... And end the season with a bang. You know, I mean, look at The Walking Dead. When we had the first half mid-season finale. What, they were in the middle of that battle with the Reapers. And then when we came back for part two. It started off right where we left off. That, that rocket missile thingy firing down on them. Um, and we just kept going right with the battle and just kept going action and and all sorts of you know awesome stuff you don't want to start with a filler episode i mean did that episode progress the story at all did it i mean i feel like it really didn't progress the story at all so yeah i don't know just not the way you want to start the second half of the season with a filler episode you know but Hopefully this episode here will be better. Uh, let's see. It's called Morning Cloak. Uh, when Charlie shows up at the tower unexpectedly, Howard recruits a young ranger in training to determine the reason for her visit. As they journey beyond the tower together, Charlie's true motives are revealed. Oh, Lenny James actually directed this episode. Okay. Um... The episode sounds a little fillery. I mean, that's just going by the synopsis, but it does sound a little fillery. And if that's true, not a good way to start off the second half of the season with two filler episodes. Couldn't you have at least waited to like episode 12? 13 maybe to do the filler episodes i don't know but i mean that is pretty cool that lenny james is the director of this episode so it'll be very cool to see um what he's like as a director i don't know if he's directed any other episodes um but this is the first one i've seen so it should be pretty cool to see you know what he's like as a director all right so anyways let's take a look at episode 10 called morning cloak here we go. Okay, seems Vickers. like he's in charge. Howard sent for me. I ran up here as fast as I could. Let me uh, send these boys out to meet Victor on his scout and uh, see if I can find Howard. Maybe he wants me to join them. How old are you, Ollie? Fifteen. Fifteen. Someone's a little ready? eager. Ready to be arranged. Yes, sir. I'm ready. I'm guessing he's not going to make it through I this episode. Just I know Victor does too, but everyone has got to start somewhere. What you gonna do, kid? Walker gotcha. or butterfly? Gotcha. Okay, or both. Now, how do you even know if that's the right butterfly or not? Ooh. Oh. Okay. Got a little struggle going on here. Oh. Ooh. Take your mask off. Who's trying to steal my stuff? Ah. It's just a kid. One of Morgan's. Yep. <laughs> Take her away. Be okay, kid. Just stay calm. Well, I've been looking for a way into this place for a while now. I just thought that maybe one of your people would have blueprints. Or could just ring the bell. To help me sneak in. For what purpose? I want to live here. Why not just use the call box? Because she knew Victor would say no. Why? Because they have a checkered past. How do you know that? I know everything. I'm Strand's I butler. Victor. I know everything. Garcia, what happened? Where's Victor? 
Damn, he looks like he got roughed up. The other rangers? That place was cruel, dead. They didn't make it. Those are radiation rooms. How do you know that? Sure, you want to be that close yeah, to him? You see him a lot out there. You wouldn't understand. What the hell was that? Okay. Garcia jumped. Triple Indy off the ledge. Did he get a ten? See him down there. Out of the wall now, player. Oh, just got a little bigger. Life. What for him to kill himself? Garcia promised he'd do anything he could to protect this place. Uh oh, Are they coming in. If so, I want to see someone get killed by a bowling ball. <laughs> I don't know how, but it'd just be cool. Oh, he's got a shotgun. Okay, so this must be their little outpost. Oh, never mind, they're leaving. Come on, it'll only take like five minutes. I'll show you when we get back from getting what Howard wants from the elevator. But what if I don't make it back? And what if you don't? I smell foreshadowing. No, Is she gonna get a strike? That was good, seriously. Right? We should beginner's luck. Down. Okay, so there she goes, off on her own, climbing up. And she's in. Hands up. Oh. Well, that's timing. Please, let me put my mask on. It's not safe in there. No mask for Open you. Open the door. Now. Oh. Oh, he's pretty smart. <laughs> Listening in, hearing the walkers, and then um, opening and getting out of the way. Now pull a Jurassic Park and just oh, 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 sneak back inside and lock the door. Oh, never mind. Grab the gun. He's dead. Uh-oh. He, oh. Okay, he lowered his gun for a minute. It's like, hmm. There must be someone he knows. He's shaking. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, oh. Oh. It's getting closer. Walker. It was someone he knew. I thought maybe the uniform. I had it covered. Did you? I saw what you did outside. It was the only way. Morgan sent me. To do what? I'm supposed to turn off the beacon on the roof tonight. Why? Hmm. Clear out the walkers so they can get Grace and the baby out. And then what? Ah, they attack? Okay. I don't know. Holly. Yeah, what's he talking yes. about? I did. Guess he had a secret assignment. Uh oh, here come the walkers. Wait, I'll leave. I'll leave. What are you doing? Protecting the tower. Here they come. Yeah, I got the board. Coming back now. Ah, so we came back. He's still gonna die, I'm betting it. Oh. This is where he gets bit in the leg. I'm, I'm counting on it, you know. Okay, I guess not. on my patrols we can hold up for a bit. Until we find something better. Charlie? Uh oh. What's wrong with her? She was exposed to radiation. Yeah, she'll be fine. The Rangers. She'll be yeah. fine. Well, At least she got possible. splattered in the face with radiation blood and like... she was fine. Why is Charlie here? What did Morgan send her here to do? Morgan didn't send her. What was your second mission? She was telling us the truth. Oh wow, she actually is infected. 
Huh. I'm scared, Ollie. And here I thought this was just like a bluff to, you know, get those two to come into a room and then she will you come with me? fill them in on what's happening. Happy birthday, Charlie. Welcome to the butterfly room. Beautiful. Oh, this he's gonna do it. Uh oh. Yep. Okay, they want this place to change, and that can't happen with Strand. That's where you're wrong, Ollie. It's the only way. So he is going to be the one that kills him. Please, Howard. Don't do it, please. I'm sorry. It's what Victor would do. Is it? Oh. Well. Charlie, what's wrong? It's... Tell me. You want to just... What is it? No matter how much time you have left, you will live to see Strand go down. I will do everything oh, I can. Oh, so she is so dying. Happens. Okay, so it looks like she is not making it through this season. And looks like they're not going to have Madison kill her. Thank you. All right, so there we go. Episode 10. Um, yeah, felt like another filler episode. Nothing really happened, it seemed. Story really didn't progress all that much. Um... Charlie went in the tower to supposedly turn off the light. Um, I guess to send a signal to Morgan. And that was really it. Yeah, we went and looked for some elevator parts. But, like, it seemed like nothing really pushed the story forward at all. Uh, so it does seem like Charlie, I guess, is dying, I guess. Um, you know, from what June said at the end, you know, um, no matter how much time you have left, you'll see Strand fall. Um, so yeah, I guess she is not making it through this season, I'm guessing. Looks like Madison's not going to be the one that, that, uh, kills her. I guess they're not going with that direction. I mean, we don't even know where, where the hell Madison is. I mean, she could be 50 miles away from where they are, so you know um she might be completely brainwashed you know from that teaser teaser trailer you know we saw you know no we will tell you who you are so i mean she might not even remember who she is don't know but um yeah so i guess charlie's dying apparently i don't know how radiation works in in uh fear the walking dead's universe you know um you can get splattered in the face with radioactive blood and be fine i guess standing around dead radioactive zombies though nope i don't know you you tell me the rules <laughs> i don't know the rules and and how radioactive blood and radioactiveness works in Fear the Walking Dead, but, um, yeah, I don't know. She apparently caught it. Uh, Ollie didn't, I mean, not like it matters, he's dead, uh, but yeah, he didn't catch it and he had his mask off the entire time, well, most, most of the way, um, so yeah, I don't know how it works. Flip a coin, maybe? You're infected, you're not. I don't know. Uh, yeah, we obviously all knew Ollie was going to die. Um, I kind of thought it was going to be a walker that does it, but nope, it was, uh, you know, Strand's butler. Uh, but yeah, uh, you know, at first I did think Charlie was faking that sickness as a way to um, go back to the tower and get June and Grace alone to, to you know, be like, hey this is why I'm actually here, this is what I'm doing, you know, I want to, you know, fill you guys in, uh, type of thing, but apparently not, so, yeah, but, um, other than that, just, just felt like a complete filler episode, you know, nothing really pushed the story along, um, 
I mean, so far, we've had two filler episodes. Hopefully, I mean, maybe we're getting the filler episodes out of the way. And then the rest of the episodes will be more stuff happening. You know, um, I don't know. Your guess is as good as mine. I'm, you know, I guess instead of having like action at the beginning and then filler episodes in the middle and then back to action, maybe we're getting the filler episodes out of the way and then the rest is going to be all conflict and action stuff. Uh, I don't know. Um, I, don't, I don't know. But, um, yeah, it seems like uh, it looks like Lenny James did a really good job uh, directing the episode. Uh, I don't know if he's done any other ones. Let's see, Lenny James. Uh, let's go here. Film, television, video games. Oh yeah, he was in Destiny and Destiny Two. Uh, I don't really see his directing stuff let's see maybe if I jump over to this page here uh, actor writer producer director oh no that's it that is it that's the only thing he has directed oh he's actually done three episodes he did um welcome to the club in 2020 he did till death in 2021 and then morning cloak what the hell was welcome to the club Welcome to the club. That was which one? Oh, Virginia. Forces Alicia and Strand to clear an unusual walker threat. Ah, uh, okay. So that's all he's done. He's only uh, directed three um, three episodes. He's hasn't done anything else. So I mean, he lo looks like he did a uh, really good job. I mean, not like I can really not like I can really tell on how good director or anything like that is so but yep yeah, so anyways uh there we go there is um episode 10 yeah you know i mean two filler episodes starting off the uh the second half of the season not so good uh yeah i guess it is what it is so yeah seems like charlie's dying i guess uh radioactive air is is gonna do her in and not Madison it is what it is I guess it'll be interesting to see what direction they go with her though uh, not sure who else is not going to uh, make it through this season um, it looks like already Charlie um, I highly doubt Alicia is gonna die I really can't see that uh, Strand, maybe, unless, I don't know, I don't know, unless, um, Alicia dies, Strand dies, Charlie dies, I mean, that'd be brutal, and then season eight, we have another soft reboot, all new characters, you know, because season four was a soft reboot, and we got all the new characters and stuff, maybe season eight, another soft reboot with all new characters because you know charlie's dead alicia's dead strand's dead uh we got madison back it always seems like there needs to be a clark on the show i mean we started with nick madison alicia and then we lost nick and then we lost madison alicia was the only one and now alicia's like uh, I, don't, I don't i don't know you're just kind of here and there might survive might not so if she dies then we got madison the only we still got a clark and i don't know it'll be it'll be interesting that's all i can say so anyways uh, i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did hit that thumbs up button it'd be awesome remember feel free to subscribe to my channel follow me on social media links are in the description box below and of course leave me all your thoughts and comments what did you guys think about the episode did you like it did you not like it uh, did you feel like it was just another filler episode and they're not really moving the story along? Uh, what do you think about Charlie? Do you think she's going to make it? Or is she actually dying? You know, like like June said, how much time you have left. I'll make sure, you know, you see Strand fall, whatever she said. Uh, let me know. 
And uh, other than that, uh, just stick around. More videos are on the way. And I will see you guys next time.